And what is this place? Where am I? I can feel something moving closer. Empress Emily Caldwin. I am a friend of your father's from the bad old days. I never expected us to meet. I watched your mother die at the hands of schemers who wanted your little empire. Then you were rescued by a man in a strange mask. I thought that was the end of the excitement. But someone yanked the rug from under your feet. You've lost your throne and your father. And I promise, Delilah won't just give them back. So, what are you prepared to do about it? Your Imperial Majesty? And are you clever enough to do it without spilling a river of blood? I asked Corvo those questions 15 years ago. This is the moment that changed him. Now it's your turn. No. Whatever you're offering, I can make my own way. Another surprise. So be it. All the stories, they're true. What is that? It feels... Know you. Do you, Do you remember? remember? It's, it's been, been so long. And you've been through, through so much. much. Even, Even as, as an, an echo, echo of myself. myself. It's, it's good, good to, to know, know you're there. Mother? You're here, but you're not here. In my hand, but somewhere else. Only the last of my essence. With you for a while. If only I could reach across this great expanse and take you into my arms. But I have this to offer my gift and my curse. Summon me to your hand, and I will guide you when I can. Delilah, really? How could she? I don't understand. There's no one quite like Delilah. I watched her pull herself up from blood and filth until she was in a position to steal from the wisest scholars in the Empire. Survival and ambition, art and magic. With a cunning that makes fawning and sick offense of those around her, all of it leading to what you saw at Dunwall Tower. Delilah's playing the long game. She took all the abuse the world could deal out, and now she has a crown. But I'll let you in on a secret. She's got her eyes set on a much greater prize. When I was ten years old, bored with my lessons, I dreamed about sword fighting and sailing the ocean. Now I'm realizing that the world is stranger than I ever imagined. Everything I know has been turned on its head, but I'm 
dealing with it the best I can. When you look at the great jeweled map at Dunwall Tower, Karnaka is the southernmost port in the Empire. A fat, red ruby. That's how I always thought of it. Up close, the city smells like the ocean and strange spices. Up close, it's a tangled story of blood and ambition. The birthplace of my father. Megan Foster is a stranger, but there's something that makes me want to trust her, despite her guarded disposition. She got me out of Dunwall, and I need answers. Delilah and the Duke made me look like a murderer, using the crown killer to butcher my political adversaries. They took what was mine, and I'm gonna get it back. You're up. All right. You've explained part of it. But what were you and Sokolov doing here? The old man loved Karnaka, but he'd caught wind of a conspiracy tied to the Crown Killer. He wanted to warn Corvo. There are reports about tensions rising, corruption, street violence. I. Didn't give it much mind. Usually the local authorities resolve that sort of thing. <sighs> the new Duke has let things slide. But Sokolov concluded he might be the head of the conspiracy. He came in looking shocked, and if you've heard his after-dinner stories, you know that's unusual. We were going to set out for Dunwall, but something happened. The Crown Killer. Yes, the hatch ripped open and Sokolov screamed. All I caught was a glimpse of someone carrying him across the deck. I followed as long as I could, toward Adermeyer Institute. It's run by the alchemist Hypatia. Maybe the Duke is using a patient of hers. The Crown Killer. Adermeyer. All right. I'll get inside. The Crown Killer has to be eliminated, and if the alchemist will cooperate, maybe I can learn something about what happened to Sokolov. Wish me luck. If you need my luck, Sokolov's as good as dead. When you get done at the Institute, disable the Watchtower. Once it's down, I'll bring the boat around. We'll take the skiff to the shore when you're ready.
ready for me to drop you at the docks. Let's go see the streets where my father grew up. Off we go then. It won't do to be recognized. to Adamire by boat, but security's too tight. The Grand Guard have a watchtower there. Go inland, and use the carriage station. Before his death, the old Duke of Sircono spent decades building up Karnaka. After Duke Luca Bell took over, he started draining the wealth out of the city as fast as he could. Orgies and week-long feasts having more fun here than we were in Dunwall, it seems. Watch yourself on the way to Ademire. The Duke's given the Grand Guard run of the city. Strangers get attacked on sight. I'll keep my head down. This is a good spot. Reach Ademire, take out the Crown Killer, and find out where Sokolov was taken. The Alchemist, Hypatia. She'll help if she can. Sokolov likes her. I'll see you later at Adermeyer. Just wait to bring up the boat until after I've disabled the watchtower. Welcome to Karnaka, stranger. Another skipper? Outside his crooked cock! Hello there! You know that was supposed to go to ice. What are we supposed to do now? We're out of money. Oi! Hey! It wasn't his fault, Mike. I'm sorry, every now and then one of those Grand Guard bastards pulls us stuff. In the distance. It's getting worse. But I might be able to help you out. We're listening. There's a stack of goods that no one's claimed in one of the holding warehouses. I happen to know that no one's gonna claim it ever, because it was... Dropped from a boat, loading up for freight board. It's good stuff. Spices and dried fish. Oh, this is all right. It is. Nah, not this time. <sighs> I'm the first to admit it, but I'm scared. And there, I said I'm scared. So, I have the following announcement. New restrictions are now in place. Let you blood flies stop us. I'm in. Just remember to move slowly and don't get too close to the nests. We don't even know if the people inside had any money. We just know they're dead and the place is infested with blood flies. Carl, going through there puts us on the other side of the wall of light. If you want out of the city as bad as I do, this is our chance. No. More likely we all get stunned. Hey, come here. Everyone is looking for me. It might pay to be discreet. I warned you. Please, you gave me no choice. Please. It's too late for that, Rapallo. Guess what happens next? This is how we get rid of snitches. Um, 
anyone asks, he just ran through it. Yeah, just once, I'd like to see her buy the drinks. Just one time. Is that too much to ask? Hey, is the windmill turning all right up there? No problems? It's turning. Plenty of electricity. Good. I like this setup better than using the well oil tanks. The wind won't run dry. Unless something happens to the windmill, these break down just as often in a different way. And they also overcharge sometimes. The wind picks up too strong? Like in a storm? Right. And if that happens, trust me, don't stand too close to the wall of light. Shankers. Isn't it laundry day yet? Gotta be soon. I can't stand my own stench. Something's got to give. a search for heretical artifacts. What? Here? Listen, I only need This to... area is restricted on the authority of the Abbey. No one is allowed inside. As bad as things are here, I love the light in the evenings down near the water. There's something now perverse in this place. Dig deep, brother. Remember that the profane seeks to hide itself. You know not the mind. If the deviant for their thoughts are drowned in dark... city once, before the Duke began choking the life out of the place, before the Crown Killer started painting the walls red. Now you're here, and I have to wonder whether you're going to give it that final nudge, or pull it back from the edge. We've both seen cities go bad before. Vermin, blood, and betrayal. It's happening again. I hope you're ready.
feel so bad. I haven't seen the kids in two years. Fellow Zirconians, in the Duke's absence, I have the following announcement. As a response to violent crime and foreign interference in our affairs, travel between districts is restricted to those carrying the appropriate permits, including citizens moving between home and work. Any attempts to hinder the Grand Guard in their enforcement duties will be met with the exercise of force. Any complaints as to the behavior of the Grand Guard should be addressed to the nearest guardsman. More Grand Guard soldiers. Best to avoid. So many people trying to get away from Garnaca now. But where are you gonna go? There's money here, even if it's dirty. I wonder who that was. Chaos not seen since the time of the great. Stay to the flesh that is familiar, that of the fowl and sheep, the ox and fish from the cold ocean.
Mm. Sometimes I wonder if it wouldn't be better to craft the music boxes at each enclave. Here in the city, for instance. Instead, they're made in a few locations, kept from us, and shipped out. It seems dangerous. Far worse to have the knowledge of construction materials scattered across the aisles. The metals used to make the devices are unusually rare. The techniques, if applied by anyone but the most faithful, resolute overseers, would border on heresy. I suppose you're correct. It grieves me to imagine what cultists might accomplish if they took the music boxes and perverted them to their own ends. <sighs> exactly, brother. Much better to protect such a powerful tool. Assemble them in secret and dispatch them across the Empire where they're needed in the fight against the supernatural. <laughs> Heretic's body is important, even though I don't fully understand the situation. We'll wait for the Vice Overseer. When should Burn arrive? He's engaged currently. He'll send someone else. The Heretic's corpse attract blood flies, brother? No, I've dusted it already. He should be fine now. But on me, anyone who shows up here has ill will at heart. There are no coincidences in Karnaka.
Nothing here. Let's have a look around. <clears throat> but strictures. He's just unconscious. I smell heresy on you. For the Abbey. Take comfort from the strictures. Uh, sink roots into the bedrock of the community has I don't like that. Better have a look. looked up at me and asked what shrines to the outsider could be found across the aisles. She affected a look of innocence, but beneath it I saw guile. My suspicions arose at once, and I questioned her sharply until she confessed to playing alone in an empty woodcarver shop at the edge of town. Each day for a week, she crept back to that place. And there in the cellar, she found cloth of purple and red, suspended from the walls, and a wretched altar of candles burned low. Some small trinkets of bone, and a few coins left by those within the outsider's wicked cabal. Those cursed figures who hunch and shamble just outside the lights of our city, 
whose faces we do not recognize, and whose voices are strange to us. Anyone here? Show yourself! What a day. The dinner service was late, the bath bottle was too warm, and let's see, oh yes. What? You're not supposed to be here! <laughs> My luck, it'll be that sadistic. I don't want to die! This time, they say I'm thinking we need another evening at the room club. That's a horrid idea. We should go to the room sometimes. <laughs> Ademeyer Station. This should take me out to the Institute. Ademeyer Station? No one ever goes out there anymore. Or rarely. I could transfer you to the Dust District. More Grand Guard soldiers. Best to avoid. Welcome to Winslow Safes. Feel free to have a look around. This is the finest safe shop in all the aisles. You're in the right place.
don't just wander wherever you want. That area's private. This must be the alchemist's apartment. Alexandria Hypatia. Flies have flourished with all the Duke's executions. I spend less and less time here at my apartment, but my work at Adamire demands it. After the horrible failures of my first serum, um. I'm more determined than ever to help the miners. It's not my say how hard the Duke and his cronies drive the workers, but until he sees reason, I'll do what I can to make their lives better and to provide comfort to their families. It's my obsession, this work, and the impact it will have on the least privileged people in Karnak. Studying the original plague elixirs. I'm close to something. When I find Hypatia, I'll see what she knows about the Crown Killer. This is the finest safe shop in all the aisles. You're in the right place.
Adonar Station. This should take me out to the Institute. Thank <laughs> you. 